right guys and welcome to Dolce Campo Real here in Lisbon, Portugal. Carter is sadly two up. Carter's cruising. No, cruising for a bruising. I've been in this situation before but the other way around so I'm mm. not going to take it for granted. Really, really tricky uh, fourth hole of the block, 13th hole here. I've got a four iron but I'm leaving it on the list. Alright, play well. Yeah, you too. Is it just gone through? It's on the fringe. Next, it's on the fringe near the flag. Back left. Yeah. Let's hope it's not too close to like the next cut of grass. Because that could be awkward. You went with four, did you? Yeah. Well, I hit that. It was beautiful. I'm not going to lie. It was nice. I came in a little bit shallower, ball position further back in the stance, less backspin, and it just came out flat. It came out. My like beauty. I'm not sure if I can get there with three. Yeah, you can, you gotta pump it. Oh yeah, 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 I can see your back edge, back right. You're alright though, you're dancing. Oh, it's close. Interesting second. It is indeed, you've got a long way to go. <laughs> yeah. I am ready. These are two, two tasty little putts. So Fletch is there. I am just here. Lots of grass to cover before I hit green. And Fletch is on the edge of the green, so Obviously Fletch to go first as he's further away, but just the fact that he's putting on at least the same surface all the way just makes it a little bit more inviting. I've got half green, half fringe. Both of these puts are massively downhill. We are, we are on a slope here, quite a severe one. So Fletch has got a lot of kind of right to left, a lot of downwind and downhill. Mine is just straight down and downwind. I'm not sure how this could end up, we could par this in fourth. Oh, that's high, he's hit it hard, has he stayed up? Oh, wow. I thought you, I straight away I said, oh, he's hit that hard, I thought you'd hit that solid. Wow, right. That was like pretty short. That was very, very short, it's like you've hit it with a sponge. <laughs> I like that one, just hit it with a sponge. See ya. See ya. Look at that. Oh wow. It's not as it's not as if the heart's not hold hard hard enough for that pin. The length of it, the pin position. Even though it was a long distance, I probably shouldn't have missed that. It was quite straight and uphill. Oh, Ready. <laughs> Take it away. <laughs> right, I did say we could halve this in pogies, and we did. Two nine six to clear the right side of the 
the lake, uh, the, sh the ditch. Driver for Carter. Not sure yet, I'll see what you do. Oh. Yeah. Joys of going, the only joy of going second in match play. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna hit the wind strong off the left as well. Well, this is gonna get the treatment. Hit it hard. Oh, I've played the fade. Can't see it on the camera. Miles over there. Miles? Oh. Should I be going there? About 50 past it. 50. Oh, that's why when you was talking them numbers, I was just like, yeah. It is, it's just that, just pushing yeah. on it. Past it. There it is on the slope. So where did it pitch though? 50 past? It pitched into the upslope. Just into the upslope. Yeah. You're more than welcome to grab the bush and then check it. No, no. It just looks too close anyway. It does look very close, doesn't it? But you got to remember it's probably 50 downhill. Ah, no, that's true. I think the same ball flight, that high fade. It's a good one. Thank you. Imagine if you had a bit of technology in your hand, do you imagine how far that could have gone? I know, I hate God. I hate God. Yeah, yeah. Lip arts destroy you. Destroy you. Right, Fletch, how far do you have? I see you've uh, managed to negotiate it just level with the water, just just yeah. shy of the nearest point. You were talking 300s near the bridge. See, I told you it was that far. Force management. You know. Yeah, it's clever that, really clever. Thank you. So I got 150. Going with a smooth eight. Smooth eight. Lie okay? Silky smooth. Lie is lovely. Could potentially get me a fire. I think the camera was a bit shaky because I was giggling. <laughs> <laughs> Only because you said I hit it heavy and left. I thought that was quite funny. <laughs> what numbers you got? 107. 107. Four below the feet. Let it feed on in. Let it feed on in, yeah. Called it. Looks alright, doesn't it? Yeah, it looked very good from here. It's going towards the number 14. Okay, so I'm extremely happy with my outcome. Play I kind of called it as I said it see it land or it's really difficult to circle it's such an uphill. Fletch is pin high as well but left side so he has to get up and down. Maybe he could chip in, he's not chipped in all week. This could be the time. It's a tricky one though because about two or three feet after the flag it's all downhill to where I'm stood. Not to mention if you look at that flag as well it's downwind so he's got to be careful. Not too careful. He is up against it here. Rob Blooms for Fledge. You know when it's just sitting up really nice and you cut under the grass? Yeah, I do indeed. Yes. 
Been there many times. Yes, yes. Right, you want to go ahead and try and tap yours in? Just, just, just tap that in. Come on. Ooh. Hard luck. Take that away, Pete Bogey. Yeah. Just frustrating in first holes. You need to get mentally stronger. Forget. And carry on. Get the woes. That's it. Come on, Carl. Roll it in. Make me feel good. Right, Carter's free up, on to the next. Okay, so we're over to the 15th. Tricky, well, tricky and interesting hole. So this tree here is 240, and then it's 290 to the bridge. And then it's obviously like 310 or so to carry it. So I'm out with a two iron. Fletcher's out with a four iron. So I'm being a little bit more aggressive. I'm going to make sure I keep the ball in between the, the gap in the trees there. Somewhere to the right side of that bridge is my idea. I, I say idea because it's not guaranteed. Mm. I am in danger if I pull it left a little bit. Yeah, that's why I've gone with slightly less club. Wind's in too. So again, it's playing long. So I don't, I don't, you know what? I don't actually mind even hitting it into the tree. As long as it just doesn't drop behind it. <laughs> Remember you see that as kids? Yeah. Overhang that tree overhanging the seventh at debut. Just just hit it and hit just it into the tree and hope it drops on the green. Yeah. Right, so Make Eagle. <laughs> or out of bounds. <laughs> so I'm gonna go down the right side little draw. It's a lovely, lovely view. Thank you. No no. Oh, it's just going right at this tree, guys. Should be good. Oh, no, go. Oh, wow. Oh, you'd be fine, I think. Oh, all right, look. And that could be position. Actually, I suppose it is 250 to the tree, wasn't it? 250. Yeah, I might just go get three iron. It's into wind. Get a little bit more. I actually was expecting it to land level with the tree, to be honest. Was you? Yeah. Bigging myself up there, aren't Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've not had a foot drop this, this vlog, so it's about. I'm due one. Or two, maybe three or four. Maybe, maybe. Just put, the, just put the ball back on the tee. I've missed, I've left a few in the jaws as well. Have you? I've not held a putt all day. How can you say that when you've had a birdie? Yeah, but I hit it close. <laughs> Surely holding a putt means outside like 20 feet. Right, okay. Apart from the second, I may have got away with it. Hit ball. Yeah, I may have got away with it on one and two. <laughs> Good strike. Hold it oh. Uh oh, game over. Fletch's board, three down. No, spread it out beautifully, surely. Did it? I, I don't know. <laughs> it didn't hit him that heavy. What are your calculations saying? Alright, so this is what it's faced with anyway while you just try to figure that out. 189. 189, wow. Wow. <laughs> when your second shot's going to be longer than your tee shot. Problems. Right, so what he's got to be faced with here is. A, funnily enough, I, I don't see this tree in front of you being in the way. Not with the loft of cover, I'm going to have to take <laughs> this. Not, not as when you're hitting three iron. <laughs> uh, brilliant. What, was what are you doing with your phone? So. Know. 189 yards, he's got to go over, just, just just through the edge of this tree. Tree in the distance, he should, the ball will be up by then. Um, and yeah, and then the green's kind of there and waiting. He doesn't want to miss the flag right. Sorry, it's 156. Oh, right, okay, 156. I was thinking it was a bit harsher. Okay, so that's a little bit better. 156. So his second shot's still going to be longer than his tee shot. Three thirty-two meters. Right, one five six. What are you hitting? Eight ten. Eight ten. Now this tree's in your way, Mister Flickyson. Just ignore. 
<laughs> have to channel that, that inner compression. <laughs> we'll see. It's got to be in there somewhere. Right, okay. Okay. Put it towards. Okay. Right. Play as if it's a tour iron back foot. That was bang on line. Oh, that looks like it could be quite good. Yeah, very good shot. Well played, well negotiated from there. Compression! Well done, welcome Flicking to the world through, of compression. Flicking through impact, best way. Tree, tree, and more tree. Extremely accurate, I'm okay. So it's in my way. It's amazing when you hit them low fins how they can just go under branches, isn't it? I wouldn't know, Fletch. Ah, okay. I might shoot high numbers, but at least it's pure. <laughs> <laughs> right, 113. Um, I'm just going to punch a little pitching wedge. This tree, that, that only overhanging is the only issue I've got, so I'm just going to try and play a little draw with it as well. One thirteen, just gotta get your yardage right. Little half, half swing. Half swing. There's a bit, a bit of turn on that one. Wow. Had the draw though. Hard to tell, we'll see when we get there, won't we? Yeah, I've never seen someone draw a pitching wedge so much in my life. Player. Player, player! If you say so. How have you seen it, Carter? I feel like it's a big left to right. I've just walked it a couple of times. So it's definitely downhill. And I'm going to aim about three, three feet outside the left, out left edge. Three feet. I feel like it's really going to move. Let's move around there guys, so we can get a better view. Wow, look at his feet, they are aiming left. Here it. I it was fast. I tried to talk myself out of it being so fast. Try, try to think it was just medium pace or something. I just told myself at the start it was going to be a really fast putt and then I got over it and thought, well, don't leave it short. Hmm. I call that a memory. A um, concentration lapse of quite a high calibre. All right. Slightly uphill, left to right for me, it's looking. Yep, I think you've definitely got the easier one with it being uphill. A bit more aggressive. Oh, I can't believe I just did that. Like I wasn't even aware of what was going on. Really, you usually like those ones, little softy ones, they just push it along the slope. Alright, you need this one. Get it in close. Wow, a bit bouncy. See that get airborne? Yeah. You good it's Hmm. Ah, you're decent from there, take it away. Sure. Take it away. I can't believe you had to even think, to be honest, but okay. But thank you, thank you. I was going to say, a bit of gratefulness if it wouldn't go amiss. Wouldn't, would it? How you seen it? How was, how was it feeling? Left foot heavy on that one? Left foot was heavy on that one, yeah. Okay. A lot of weight gone into that left side then. Really annoyed at myself in that first putt. Just wasn't even switched on. Right, just outside the right edge. Firm. Ooh. That was a decent putt. First one shocking. 
Right, she's so back, back to two. Back to two and that's the end of part two. Two down with three to play for me. It was just not meant to be that hole. Nope, nope, we'll give up on that one. First putt was a killer. Right, yep. massive, massive thank you to Dolce Campo Real Golf Resort here in Lisbon. And massive thank you as well to Glencore Holidays for this whole trip that they both have organised for us. Um, big thank you as well to Lisbon Tourism Board. And please do subscribe to the channel and follow us on our social media platforms. See you again very soon. See you guys.